Hello, everyone. Welcome to the next episode of Campaign Connection. Now, I have a special guest joining me today because what fun way to celebrate a makeup launch than with a friend, right? We are talking about the new Match Airbrush Retouch Tinted Primers. And we're also going to be shouting out the new Glimmer Liquid Color Eyeliner Pens in four beautiful shades. Welcome, Rhea. Thank you so much. This is such a treat to have you. Hi, Jonathan. I'm so glad to be here. Thank you so much for having me. Yes. So we are excited. It's such a treat. Now, uh, you've been working very intimately with this product uh, since uh, even before our launch date today. Now, okay. is there anything that you can tell us about these primers and these liners that makes it stand out from the rest? Why do we need it now? Okay. So this primer is amazing because not only is it a primer, you saw it, it's also tinted. So you have a very light tint that's just going to perfect your complexion and it's going to give you this filter effect that i absolutely adore and the eyeliners we have to talk about them jonathan they're so beautiful and so pigmented and it's just such trendy colors that everybody is looking for right now yeah Easy look at that my beautiful look. felt tip and i also have the colors here Oh yeah, look at that. They're so gorgeous. They're smudge proof. They're, you know, they don't budge all day. You apply them and then you're good to go for the rest of the day. I love that. Yeah, I actually applied this like three hours ago just to get ready for this. And I was like, I'm going to reapply it later. I didn't need to. Look at that. Yeah, they're gorgeous. They're absolutely stunning. And speaking of this, can I show everyone? I'm sure when I saw the package, I was like, what, what is the applicator to this? I just have to show everyone for everyone viewing when you get your product, because you guys are going to want this. It is a beautiful doe foot applicator. Oh yeah. And you said something about like uh, filtered skin. Um, fun fact for everyone right now, I am wearing it right now. Look at this. I mean, I woke up and I was like, my skin feels good. And then I put this on and I was like, whoa, my skin looks like absolutely perfected. I'm just going to take a minute right now. <laughs> you look gorgeous. You really do look like you have a filter. That's, it, it, it really delivers. Yes, I absolutely love this. So really cool things. Uh, four beautiful shades for everyone uh, that just melts into the shade of your skin. So absolutely love that. Now, as a treat for everyone, we have two really cool videos that we took some time to create. The first one is of me, um, yours truly. And what I did was I wanted you guys to see uh, the difference of when you put it on um, on one side of the face and then when I don't have anything on the other. So we're going to pop that video up also, um, mainly because you can also use these, like Rhea said, just as, on its own. And that would be my preference. The second video we're going to show is... Rhea delivering on how you can use these to really up your makeup game. And I think there's a special treat in there with some of our liners. So without further ado, let's take a look at that first video. So I'm going in with the FMG Match Airbrush Retouch Tinted Primer in shade Medium Deep. The next thing I'm doing is using that doe foot applicator that it comes with to apply it to my face. For this video, I'm applying it to half of my face so you guys can really see the difference between both sides. The next thing I'm doing is I'm going in with a beauty sponge and just lightly tapping in to apply the product. And what you're gonna notice right away, especially on my cheek and my forehead area, is I still have a nice healthy skin-like glow. The difference here is I have a nice retouched look that looks effortless. So if you want a look that is glowing and looks like you have a filter, this product is for you. Okay, so I hope you guys liked that. You know I will do it for you where I have only one face, uh, part of my face not done and part of my face kind of done. So because I love you guys, I had to do that. Uh, Rhea, what did you think of the side by side? Jonathan, like I said before, it was so amazing. You could really see the difference of filter, no filter. It's as if you had these skin enhancers on your skin. I absolutely love it. Amazing. Yes. Okay. So what I loved about it, uh, first and foremost, is I'm a texture person. Right when I put it on the skin and I uh, applied it with a doe foot and then I went in with a beauty blender, um, I absolutely loved the way it just pressed onto the skin and it felt like skin for me. 
um, no cakiness around my eyes, around my my forehead area where I'm where I usually see um, foundation settling in a little bit. It was gone right here on my nose, right here on the forehead and the eyes, completely like airbrushed, like it was a, a beautiful filter, and I, and I stick it, that sticks in my head all the time. So. Uh, for this, this is my new uh, haul when I'm looking at just quickly touching up my face. This is all I need. This is even with no foundation. So I hope you guys like it. Uh, for the second treat, we have the video from our gorgeous Rhea. She's going to take us through a tutorial on how to really maximize this collection. So let's take a look. First, I apply the FMG Match Airbrush Retouch Tinted Primer in the shade Light Medium as a base. Using the FMG complexion brush with the buffing foundation side, I tap the product to blend it seamlessly into my skin. Next, I take the shade Tan Deep and apply it along my hairline, the sides of my nose, and my jawline for a lifting effect. Before blending, I will add the shade Fair Light as a highlighter to the center of my face, nasolabial folds, and upper cheekbones. Now I will blend using the same tapping technique, starting from my hairline, ensuring it's evenly covered, then the jawline and cheekbones in an upward motion for a lifted look. For the center of my face, I use the FMG concealer brush to define the sides of my nose for a slimming effect flipping it back to the foundation brush to blend everything smoothly. To finish, I use the FMG Glimmer Liquid Color Eyeliner in Forest, creating a thin wing to lift the eyes. The felt tip glides effortlessly, delivering vibrant color without needing pressure. Then I'm going to complete the look by connecting the line from the inner corner of my eye to the wing. And there you have it, a flawless lifted and defined makeup look. Whoa, okay, beautiful techniques there. I am so glad you joined us today to deliver on this. Now, Rhea, tell us a little bit about um, what you were doing and, and what you love about this product. Okay, Jonathan, so... I I got I let you guys know in the video you you saw how I used three okay so I used three of the colors you absolutely need those three you can't live without those three it's gonna it's gonna vary depending on your skin tone I don't have a very dark uh, skin tone to begin with so those are my three colors that I used in the video okay so I have the fair light that I used for the highlighting and then I have the light medium that was as my as my base to just even out my skin tone and make my skin look great overall. And I loved using the tan deep, which is the darkest shade to do the, the contouring that you saw. And this is exactly what I have on today, by the way. So I, I love them all because the fact that they're so lightweight, you don't feel like you have anything on your skin. It's as just as if you're applying your skincare and mention if I, you know, I'm talking about skincare, those products have amazing skin loving ingredients in them. They have ferulic acid, they have niacinamide and panthenol. So it's really going to work on hydrating your skin, on evening out and smoothening your skin tone, which is just going to get this. This is why it helps give you that filtered effect, Jonathan. So this is my main reason why I love them. Also, the, the shades are so flexible. So it's really going to be easy for you to choose one. You're not going to have to try a million shades to figure out which one is right for you. It's very basic. You only have four shades. So chances are, if you if you have very fair skin and you go with the lightest shade, chances, chances are it's really, really going to work out for your skin tone. Um, so that's that's what I love the most about them. I hope you enjoyed the video. You really can use it in many, many different ways. And just to compl to get like a elevated makeup look with those primers, right? So I hope okay, you guys- so, Yes, and you were talking about uh, the texture to this. I just have to show everyone really quickly. I put a little bit of the 
um, primer onto my skin. Now look at that. Now I'm going to work it a little bit into the skin here. Look how beautiful that is in terms of just making it look like skin. So, it is. It is. It's such a look at that. It's such flexible shades. Um, they really, really blend into your hand right there. And this is exactly the effect that it's going to have on your skin. It's going to be very easy to find the perfect one for you or the perfect yes. that for you. Exactly. And when you're talking about those skin loving ingredients, that to me was why my skin felt really good. I was telling you earlier, I was like, it felt like my skin. Um, and I guess that's why it's those ingredients. So I love that. And I love when makeup can be a little bit skin forward too. So that saves me the deal um, of having to make my face uh, cater towards my makeup. So beautiful things there. Now you also did apply a liner. Now I do love a good felt tip, really on point liner here. Um, can you tell us a little bit more about these? Okay, so you see that felt tip applicator? It's really gonna allow for a smooth and precise application. Like we said, they're highly pigmented. You saw the swatches on Jonathan's hands as well. And they're smudge, transfer, and sweat proof. And those are the four amazing colors. In order, I think you have indigo, then forest. Right now I have forest on. Um, mm. And that's the, also the one that I used in the video. And then you have smoked, which is more of like a charcoal color. And then, um, sorry, chestnut. They're absolutely gorgeous. Absolutely love that. So wonderful things there. And my friends, I made it easy for you because you know I like to do that. I dropped the links below for you guys to get your new makeup haul, whether you're trying to have a filtered, beautiful look or you're trying to have a beautiful cat eye. So again, beautiful tip right there to get that nice precision. Um, made it easy for you. It's in there in the links. And in the links, you also find the product snapshots for all these products in case you want to be a product expert or just look into the product more in depth. So Rhea, thank you so much for joining us and having some fun. It's always a treat to have you on and kind of give your tips and tricks about what you want. Because I initially, I didn't think we can use more than one. So beautiful. Oh, you need three. Minimum three. <laughs> okay. Well, you heard it here. Raya, thank you so much for joining. Thank you so much for having me. Yes. And for everyone here watching, keep staying tuned because I have some business updates for everyone. And Raya, thank you so much. It was a pleasure. Thank you. Bye. On to our business updates. I have two for you. The first one is just a reminder, our fast track to success has been extended to September 24th. So there is still time to achieve. The second one is something that you possibly might have heard a few times already by now. This is our Go Far Costa Rica. Now for more details on where you can learn on how to earn this trip for yourself or more details on other incentives, feel free to hop on over to the incentives hub on avon.com or avon.ca to learn more because you never know what's going to pop up on there. Okay, my friends. Well, thank you so much for joining me on another fabulous episode of Campaign Connection. I hope you have your makeup haul. Remember, I dropped those links for you there and they also have the product snapshots. That is all I have. Make sure to like, subscribe, and follow us for the next Campaign Connection. I'll see you guys soon. Bye.